So here is method number one. Now I will open up YouTube and we are going to be focusing on the search bar. Let's say we want to make a video about vidIQ. I will type in vidIQ. Observe below as I start typing the letters how it automatically suggests words and phrases that people are looking for. Now these are your keywords. The auto suggest feature is your friend. Use it extensively when researching for keywords because it is the most accurate tool that will tell you what people are searching for now on YouTube. All the other tools and extensions are built around it. Keep in mind that these suggestions refresh automatically every 15 minutes as the viewer's interest change. Now, you don't want to go after these exact keywords. Even if you want to make a video about vidIQ, you're not going to name it simply vidIQ, right? Because you will never rank for it this way. VidIQ's channel is huge, with more than 1.7 million subscribers and they have already ranked for this keyword long time ago. We are actually looking for keyword phrases that include this keyword. Let's choose one from the suggested ones. Like this one, VidIQ Pro Free. Now this looks better. Let's see the results. As you can see, there is some competition around this keyword as other creators already use this exact keyword. Now, if you don't want to keep scrolling down each time to check your competitor's titles, you can simply press Ctrl F or Command F on your Mac to open up the Find window on Chrome. Then just type in the keyword and it will show you the number of times it found that keyword on this page. We are aiming to see a number as close to zero as possible. In this case, other creators have already made videos using this exact keyword, meaning that there is actually a lot of competition. So, let's add an extra word and see what happens. Going back to the search bar and pressing space after the keyword, it will further suggest what people are searching for. I will choose VidIQ Pro Free 2023. Let's see what comes up. Now using Ctrl F and Command F on Mac, I will also add 2023 here as well to see how many results are on this page. Now this is interesting. There is actually no other video using this exact keyword. So this is a good choice to integrate it into the title of your next video. I like it because it's much more clear and specific and it's full of keywords like VidIQ, VidIQ Pro, VidIQ Pro Free and VidIQ Pro Free 2023. So this is actually what we want to discover and make videos about. Because making a video around this keyword is very powerful. It will bring you more views and you could be potentially making money even before hitting those 1000 subscribers, for example using affiliate marketing. Cause whenever somebody clicks the link in the description and makes some purchases, you will get a share from that sale. This technique is widely used on YouTube by many creators, especially bigger channels. You can use this for promoting products on Amazon, services, software or even your own digital products. Now this is not the topic of today's video, but write me a comment below if you're interested in knowing how you can start making money with a channel under 1000 subscribers.